Hey guys, and before this video starts, I just want to remind you about the giveaway that I'm doing right now. Uh, there will be a link somewhere right over here at the top right there, uh, so you can go on uh, participate on that. Again, just really easy, just uh, like that video, comment on that video, and subscribe. Don't watch this movie, please. Oh. Hey. Uh. What's up, everybody? And uh, welcome to the Midnight Channel. And yeah, so today we're going to be reviewing the uh, Bird Box or Bird Box. I don't know if, this, if there is a D or, or not. I don't remember. Anyway, so as I said earlier, don't watch this movie, it's pretty bad. Uh, but it's on Netflix, so if you already own Netflix, I guess you don't really hurt. But you're wasting your time, really. Anyway, uh, so as always, I'm gonna break down my review. This is gonna be a shorter review. I don't really want to waste my time and or anything, but I figured if I am gonna be uh, doing anything, I might as well just go ahead and, and uh, you know, say it, <laughs> right? Anyway, so we're gonna start with the story. As far as the story goes, uh, this is a pretty interesting story, but uh, it's nothing new here. So basically, this is the quiet place, but done wrong. Uh, if you see, if you haven't seen the quiet place, basically, basic plot is, uh, or or in the plot of this one, it's uh, this woman. She is pregnant at the beginning of the movie. And uh, she just found out that she's gonna have two kids or whatever, or a kid. And uh, she um, she goes down from down from then on. Uh, so these creatures are, are making other people kill each other through something with the vision. That's the basic plot of it. And uh, the issue with this movie has is that the movie takes back and forth in between two different time spans. So we have the current timeline, which is already, uh, it's been a, a couple years and she's already a little bit experienced and she has two kids that she's walking with and everything. And then um, the past time where everything is just happening, the apocalypse, so to speak. Uh, so this movie suffers from severe pacing issues. <laughs> and uh, I don't think this was a good story to do the back and forth between the different timelines because what happens is it kills every kind of tension that you can have because it can be a tension moment and it's just gonna come back to the other timeline and everything and uh, basically anything that happens in the past you know she's going to survive because you know that the present's going on and everything you know somebody's gonna die because they're not with her you know so uh, yeah so that's a, a very big problem that the um, that this movie has is just stupid to be honest with you but that being said i just don't think that this is this is uh w was really well uh, elaborated or anything uh but yeah as far as story and everything i'm gonna give it a five out of five uh, i'm sorry five out of ten uh, definitely like i said i don't think it's well executed there there's not enough of meat going on there uh, it's a little bit boring at times to be honest with you i, ca I caught myself just checking out my phones every time in a while because i was like nothing's going on for the next 10 minutes <laughs> uh but yeah so yeah uh, next, we're gonna move on to presentation. As far as presentation goes, this is an uh, okay looking movie. Netflix, you know, like always, they always do good looking movies, and for a majority of the time, they all look pretty well. Uh, Netflix has that signature style that they already set up to themselves, but so it's not bad or anything like that. However, like I said, it could be better here. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff that they just kind of just doesn't just make a lot of sense to have but it's fine you know it's netflix and they do the things that they want to do as far as the acting and everything goes within the presentation it was pretty okay you know sandra bullock uh, who's the uh, main actress she did an okay job uh i wish they had casted different children because they're supposed to be the same age but one of them look older than the other one they look like terribly different age you know like one looks five and then one looks three so it's it's <laughs> it's dumb, you know, that they look so different apart as far as the age and everything. And uh, the other thing is, there are occasionally parts that are not meant to be funny that I found myself laughing at them. Like, there's a specific part that I don't want to talk about because it's spoilers, but um, but it's just really, it's just 
was stupidly funny for some reason. Uh, but yes, yeah, so I just didn't think they did a pretty good job on that. But overall, the presentation is okay. You know, it looks it looks okay. It looks like a Netflix movie, and you know what you're looking into that. And as far as the music and everything, it was nothing. Oh, it was nothing big or anything like that. Uh, nothing. Uh, honestly, they played it safe as far as missing goes. Not nothing was, you know, out of the ordinary or everything. Uh, special effects, and everything was okay. And as far as that, I want to give it a seven out of ten. Like I said, it, it was okay. Just uh, okay at best. Not good, not bad. Just just plain okay. Uh, so if you add those up, you're gonna get a six out of ten, and I will give the movie a six out of ten. Um, overall, it's just fine but it's not good it's, it's just plain not good you'll wait be wasting your time if you watch this uh avengers infinity uh, wars is on netflix so go check that out that's pretty good and it's on netflix now so you can watch it out for free or whatever uh, but as far as this yeah just don't waste your time it's it's fine but it's just not it's it's not a good movie i don't know how netflix is saying that there's so many people watching this movie and everything i don't i don't see what the special about it because it's really not it's just it's just there and it's 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 there yeah uh, but as far as that one thing that I just want to mention is there's supposed to be these creatures that everybody's afraid of because they're gonna kill them or whatever but no no time do we see anything like that we just see like smoke or like a blurry figure going back and forth and everything we don't really see anything and that's just dumb because it, it doesn't the danger doesn't feel real because of that uh, that I feel like that's that's uh, something that could have maybe help a little bit the movie but like i said between all the stuff and the pacing issues and everything i just don't think how they could do a better job than this like i said it's just not a good movie but it's fine you know it's it's netflix they can do whatever they want with the movies but uh yeah this is definitely not a good movie but uh, yeah it's just short review here for you I just i just watched this and i want to talk about it thanks so much for watching this video and if you like any good movies or any good bad movies let me know about it i want to hear about it uh thanks so much for watching this and i'll see you next time Thank you.